day has two major parts to it. So what is the ASC conference about? Well, half of it is bringing together technicians. So these are the people that support the practical work and who are so essential and are the only real reason why we can have so many practical lessons in all of our uh, science lessons. The second part is the teacher strand, where teachers get to come together and share best practice. So we have teachers from all over Southeast Asia, so Vietnam, Taiwan, loads of different countries coming together to share best practice to help improve our teaching. And the other exciting thing is that we have a keynote. So Professor Lee Hoth from Leeds Trinity University, um, we've flown her out and she gave an absolutely phenomenal keynote. This is actually my first time coming to an ASE conference and I was really excited when I saw that there would be another one here in Bangkok. So first of all, I found it to be a really friendly conference. Everyone is willing to talk to me answer my questions, ask me questions as well. So it's a really open environment and that's the first thing I noticed. I've done CPD sessions before, but I've never hosted at a conference of this size before. Yeah, it was really good fun. It was nice to teach adults, which is an interesting change. It was great to get feedback from them as well because although I knew what I was trying to achieve and I knew what I was doing, it was quite interesting to hear their perspectives, especially of things I hadn't actually thought of before. The focus of my workshop is putting the A into STEAM education. What inspired me is I think it's really important that students come away with 21st century skills and it's not always easy for students necessarily to access the science, the technology, the maths. And I feel the importance of putting that A into STEAM is really to allow us to get that broad spectrum from everybody. Everybody has a contribution to make and by really emphasising the arts in STEAM, it allows the students to express their ideas in so many different formats and really have that collaborative practice that we can bring everybody's ideas together. I think one of the main ways that this conference will influence my teaching practice in the future is not just the things that we've been learning about, but the connections I've made. I think that's one of the best things about conferences like this, is that I've now made connections and friendships with people from other schools around Bangkok and Southeast Asia. So I think moving forward, I now have those people to bounce ideas back and forth with, talk about new ideas moving forward. So it really gets the ball rolling when you come to things like this. And you should be attend this event for next year because of the, you can gain a lot of the connection to another school yeah, and then can exchange the experiences and the way that we can uh, improve ourselves in our school. In addition, you can get uh, like a connection from the company supplier to know about the new innovation or new the model equipment that can help you a lot in your science laboratory in your school. I have absolutely loved planning the ASE and getting it all together, this conference that we've got today. And I think if anyone else is thinking of doing a conference, building a network, whether it's in science, whether it's in humanities, English, maths, PE, it doesn't matter. I think these days, the day is important in itself because you share best practice, but that network that you can take forward, that you can share with, that you can call upon, that is invaluable. And that's what we want to build here, not just the day, but the legacy continuing forward.